Hey folks, welcome back to After Work Gaming. We are back in the Solus Project, and uh, we're back in this area with the three doors. Now, quick recap, last time we picked up this device. I don't know what it does, but it does take one of these crystals in it. Uh, we also have an extra key here, and we have these two swords. Now, there is a door, I think it's on that side over there, that uh, we found that was still closed and we couldn't figure out quite how to open it. I couldn't find a keyhole last time. Uh, so right now I thought we can pick up here because if you recall last time also yikes, you know, Bomb traps there we go um, Last time we found this area right here If we push this block forward right Then we can enter here and we can put a sword and use it as a lever to open up a door so uh, I am wondering if this is a either just another area for us or if it's a place to progress. Uh, you know what? While that's opening, just in case, just in case there's a smoke monster, it is not a big fan of fire, as we found that last time. Uh, oh, you know what? There was a stone back there. Hold on, let's go back there real quick, and we will pick up the stone. Right? Yep, there it is, right there. Bam. Let's uh, grab it. And uh, go and weigh down that platform and see. I don't think it's the way forward because, check it out, the forward vector's all the way on the other side. So, I'm thinking this is probably an area where we can get a secret or something. And a very unfortunate native alien. Let's get the stone, let's drop the stone, let's get the flashlight again, smoke monster. No murals, no murals, and uh, no open top ceiling, and I have no idea what this is. There is a thing over there, right? So... Uh, you know what? I'm almost positive this is gonna hurt me, but you know what? Let's just double check. Wait. Eh, a little, a little. Biohazard Ooh, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> okay. Biohazard detected. Is it going to hurt me? I'm sure it does eventually, right? We're still at 750 health, but that can't be it. Okay. Here's the question. Here's the million dollar question. Can we skip across, essentially, right? So, like, just swim it. Well... It's not the forward vector, but I do want to know what's over there. And you know what? Fortune favors the bold, right? We got 750 health. We got plenty of health. Just get a running start, and then... We'll just swim it. Whoop! Yeah, that's like a good... Ah! Oh, this is not pleasant. This is not pleasant. Sorry. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah, it's definitely hurting me now. <laughs> Ooh, ooh, get out. Ooh, okay, okay, skull, skull time. That's right, that's right. There we go. The skull is the thing that heals you by five, every, and you can use it. Uh, well, you know what, we can take the torch, thanks. Whoa. Check that out, guys. It's a plane, or a starship. And there's lots of gold. And there is a relic. Okay, what is this? Relic of the night, resistance to hypothermia by 1%. Good. What does this say? The air carrier, one of one. Instructed we were to craft the shape for it can take to the skies. I don't really think it can. But, I mean, maybe it's just ritualistically it can, right? Doesn't seem very aerodynamic. Look at these wings. They're not going to do any sort of lift. Uh, okay. Well, that's about it. So let's... Let's go, and maybe we'll take a nap outside. There we go. I'm not sure why I couldn't do that last time. Or why I could do it this time, rather. Yeah, 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 okay. All right, let's go back outside. We will take a nap to replenish some of our health, uh, and we also need to take a drink. 
We're sort of uh, out of the okay range for water. And then we'll have to find a way out of here because I don't remember being able to open that other door. And the forward vector... I mean, we gotta hit the forward vector. So... Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's... You know what? Let's sleep for like two hours. And then we will go... We'll at least go check out and walk towards the forward vector. Right? Maybe... I don't remember if there's another door. We have another key. And I don't remember if there's another door beyond the one that, you know, in addition to, rather. Okay, that's good. And we can use for both water and food. Okay, so. Swig of water. And full of food. We're good for both. Okay, cool. So. Uh, where are we for inventory space? We've got one space. Uh, I still don't know what to do with the device, and I'm not going to do it until we learn what the heck the device is all about. So, let's see. Let's go check out that door one more time. I'm almost positive we didn't miss anything, but let's just look at it for a, a short uh, minute. And then, assuming that I'm right in my recollection that there's no way past the door that we could see, I guess we'll just... We'll go to exactly where the forward vector is, and we'll find out whether or not that's the way forward. Or whether or not there is a way forward out of this cave that I completely forgot, maybe. Uh, because the three doors, right, and the fourth, the four, you know, it's four directional crossroads. Three of, the spa three of the directions are doors. We opened the doors last time. Uh, there's only this one with this sort of, like, locked door behind it right now. Right, and there is definitely something back there, because look, there is a camp symbol. Uh, these, by the way, are these spiky traps. See? This door right here. Right? So this... I'm trying to show something, guys. Come on, don't shake it. So this is blocked up, so we can't throw a teleporter. Uh, there's nothing back here, right? I mean, we saw this. Whoops, come here. Right? None of these are weak, weak walls, no weak walls, no weak walls. This is like a weird ritualistic setup right here, where he's kind of embedded in the wall. But that's it, right? And there's no other way, and I don't see a mechanism, and I don't see a keyhole. Okay. Right, so... Let's go check out whatever's the forward vector here. Maybe... Here's a thought. Maybe there is a cave, like right there. Right, because that could kind of work. If there's a cave and we can kind of come out maybe back there, like through the other end of the door. Right, worth a shot. Let's go check it out. We got 12 and a half hours and we're okay for both food and water. Uh, which way, which way? This way. No, not this way? Come on. Okay. The cable is where we came in, isn't it? But then... See, there's no other way here. Like, there's no cave, so... There's really only one other direction, and that is the cable area. But that's where we came in, and I don't I don't think we have to backtrack. Right? Right? I remember these two statues. We went past these two statues, we went in there, and then we immediately started exploring the doors. Okay. Let's see what else we got, though. Oh. Wait a minute. Alright, let's do one thing. Oops, stop it. Okay, we did save here before. Let's just save again, just to be safe. Oh, yeah. And by yeah, I mean I completely forgot that this existed. So there is another door here, and it's right here. Look at that. Um, okay. I think I'm not going to put away the torch for now, because... Ah, the heck with it. <laughs> <laughs> you know, if the smoke monster comes, we're fast. Secluded Darkness 1. I'm assuming that's what this says. Milestone 1 of 2. Secluded Darkness. Cool. Um, whatever, let's just save it in here now. Okay. No. Ah! Can I see a door? Alright, first things first. What is this? Perk. Did not offset received. Dry faster. Okay, cool. Let's see, let's see. Alright, easy. Easy, guys. Easy. I know you don't like me here. 
Alright, there is something there. We should go check it out. But first, let's go through this door. Oh, that's the forward vector. Yeah, we're not going to the forward vector. Thank you. Let's go check out whatever is over here. Yep. Uh, well, let's, let's follow the rules that we've kind of been following that have worked so far. Right? That's gonna take us back here if we really need to. But uh, hopefully we won't. Maybe this thing is like circular. Which I love. I love it when caves are circular because that means you have to, don't have to backtrack. I'm a big fan of that because I'm lazy. Oh, there we go. Check it out. Relic of life plus 25 health. Perfect. We're at 775. Is there more? Is there more like right here maybe? Okay, we're going to do this. We're going to go like here. Boop. Jump, 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 jump. Let's get the flashlight out just because. Okay, there is a way down here. Good to know. Uh. Uh. Oh, wait. No. No. There's a thing down there. Before we go and explore that area, what is down here? Ooh. Well, we're back down to 70, uh, 750 instead of 770. Oh, this is just another way into this area. Okay. I did not expect to drop down that far and that uh, painfully. Okay, so. Here we are. This is the door we could have gone... I beg your pardon? All right. There's urchins here, and then there's these things, which are cool. Look at this. This is like some... This is straight out Lovecraft stuff, right? For some reason, I get the, um... A very, like, Mountains of Madness vibe from these things. If anybody knows what I'm talking about. The, like, the, uh, the description of the... I think they're called the Shoggoths. Um, which is basically they're like... Aren't they like cucumbers, or they're like zucchinis or something? They're basically like, uh... I always pictured them with like, this weird little like flowery bit at the top. Uh, okay. All right, easy. Easy. I'm just our marvel is this where you guys come from? Is this where you live? Is, maybe you have a symbiotic relationship with these things. All right, whatever. They're ultimately harmless. They're just noisy. Uh okay. Anything, 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 anything? Nothing. Okay. I'm seeing light, and light is always good to see. Whoa, cool. Alright, well, let's not put it away yet. There was... Was there something here? Is this... I don't know, we're just back to the, the Shoggoths over here. What is going on? Uh, minus three degrees. Yeah, it's because we're in, in ice crystal territory. And it's done. What the heck was that? We didn't even see, like, a figure or anything? Weird. These things are cool. So is this like more of the ice crystals here? No. The ice crystals are here. Cool. Okay. But we need we need fire. <laughs> it's beautiful to look at, uh, but we need fire. Okay. I'm seeing skeletons. Right? I'm seeing dead aliens. What's this? This. So it's unclear to me from these uh, like ruins. Whether this is, like, where people lived. I'm assuming this is where people worked, right? But who knows? I see stones, yeah. A wheel. Fine. Uh, is there something here? There is something here. What about here? What's, what's at the forward vector? I guess let's just go check out the forward vector real quick. This is more... Oh. Hold on. Oh! Ha 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 ha. Okay, that's good. That's good to know. But I'm seeing structures here, so let's go check out, like, 
if there's maybe something more to these structures than just... Oh, this is the central... That's the central crystal. Let's just remember that. Then there's this thing. Which leads to... Whoa, what? Milestone. The Artery of Heat. This seems like it's somewhere where, um... Okay. So there are, th uh, uh, I want to say three places, right? There's there's the, the, the staircase up, which ultimately we will be taking. There's this thing. And then there's... Let's just go back to where we were before. Okay. Like right here-ish. Adjacent here. Okay, and there's like another area back here, right? So let's let's do this. Let's explore this area first. I'm gonna drop the teleporter. Um, let's explore through here first. Then we'll explore the artery of heat, and then we will take the staircase, uh, the ladder up, and that'll probably be it, depending on how long all of this other stuff takes. What the heck? Melam Kish's cudgel two. Did we ever find Melum, Ki Melum Kish's Cudgel Part 1? I don't think so. Melum Kish's Cudgel. Interesting. I don't have any more keys, right? I don't have any more keys. We need water. Hmm. Let's just take a swig of water. We can always replenish it somewhere else. I'm pretty sure we heard it trickling around here somewhere, but we'll go we'll go there later. Ah, okay, cool. Uh, just in case. 53%. It would be nice to get up top eventually. Okay, it doesn't look like there's a smoke monster. We would see the flickering lights. Uh, these are clearly graves. Onks. Flowers. Okay. Ooh, here we go. What is, uh, first of all, let's do this. Okay, values of Usiwatar. Climate resistance, hunger, dehydration, plus 1%. Cool. And this is more health packs and food. I know there's stuff on the walls. I'll check that out in a second. In a second. Is there anything hidden anywhere? No. There's no weird walls or anything, so let's... There's a translation for that. Okay, so what I'm going to do in the comments is I'm going to put the translation for one and two. Okay? So, let's see what this says. Tomb of Priests, one of one. Here lies Unzu, Urur, Zimudar, Usiwatar, Bila, and Melamkish, all slain by the heretic Varsa, the first one to betray the enlightened. Interesting. Okay. So these are what all the graves are. You would think if these were all priests, they would get somewhat of a more fancy funeral, I guess, for lack of a better term. Ah, there it is. There's water. Perfect. We can go for more water. Let's take a swig. Then let's take... Where's the uh, empty bottle? There we go. Let's refill the bottle. We got two bottles again, and we will go back to uh, the central chamber, essentially. You know what? The hell with it. <laughs> Teleport back. Uh, now, we want to go check out the Artery of Heat, right? Which means... Let's see. Which means I'm going to throw a teleporter here and where we're going to go over here. Mission objective. Restablishing satellite uplink. Highest priority. Yeah... I think my highest priority is figuring out what this place is all about. Because I am being hunted, or at least pursued in some capacity. The Ardor of Heat, right, we already read that. Sorry, forgot about that. Ardor of Heat Part 2. Like we... Uh, what is number one, though? Whoa, reading material. Okay. Let's save this real quick. I'm not going to read these yet. Let's just see if maybe there's a... Uh... There is. There is a lot of stuff here, guys. I'm seeing bombs. See this? Okay. 
Okay, I'm seeing that thing too. I'm on to you. God, this is a dangerous area, huh? Oh man. <laughs> okay, let's just quietly try and skirt around this so that we don't have to. Tr we try not to set off anything. Okay, okay, okay. I don't want to like shortcut it because maybe there's something to be seen. Like right here, for example. Ooh. So the stairs go that way. This, on the other hand, I'm not seeing any mines here. Water? Water. We can use for some food now. We're not going to do that. Uh, let's see. Is there anything else? I'm seeing skeletons. Okay. Uh, anything? No. Okay. So, uh, let's go here. Maybe it'll connect up to where the other... Yeah, it's where the other mines are. Okay. No. No. No, 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 no. Uh... Ooh, this could be really bad. Okay. 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 <laughs> We're definitely teleporting back, though. Oh my god, guys. Oh my god. Who is singing or chanting, also? Not for nothing. And look at this. This is... gruesome. These guys didn't die slowly or quietly. Like, there's blood all over here. That's something. Okay. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. We're gonna explore- I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna explore this area and we're gonna call it. But... Uh, okay, water. Take a swig of water, no problem not to. So this is the symbol! This is a Dar Sum. Right. This guy died because the ceiling collapsed on him. Stone, stone. This is like mill wheels, right? It's not just wheels. It, they, they look like they're milling wheels. From like, uh. Hello? From like a, uh. uh some sort. Of, well, like a. Like a. They're, they're mill wheels from a, from a mill. God, I am exceptionally creative in my descriptions, huh? This, this, what is going on? Where am I? Okay. I gotta remember. I gotta remember once in a while. I gotta check the ceiling to see if there are any like bombs on the ceiling. What is this place? Holy smokes! Ah! Jesus! <laughs> oh. I'm done. <laughs> so that's what happens when you have a torch with the smoke monster around. Oh man. That scared the bejesus out of me. <laughs> okay. So, uh, we're dead. That's fine. We saved it right outside of this uh, this area. Sort of. I think it's we saved it before we started jumping around the mines. Also fine. We just need to remember that we have to keep the flashlight on rather than run around with the torch. Okay. So uh, that's that. Next time we'll pick up exactly where we left off out in front of this uh, this particular, I guess, underground temple complex. I don't even know what to call it. And uh, we'll go from there. All right? If you guys enjoyed this, like, comment, subscribe, tell a friend. Let's me know that I'm doing something right. Let's me know that you guys want to see more of this stuff. If you have thoughts on the game or thoughts on where we can go or what we can do or you think I'm doing something wrong or overlooking something, by all means, leave a comment. Everything's welcome. And in any case, I'll see you all next time.
Got a root, got a root, got a root, got a root. 